Welcome back, Toucan Flock, to another exciting episode of Toucan Plays. And I'm here as well. <laughs> Monster Jam Steel Titans 2. We're going to be playing with Grave Digger Overcast today. I think he looks pretty cool. And I do have Joseph with me, our resident Grave Digger fan. Not that I'm not a Grave Digger fan, but Joseph is our super fan. It is a pretty cool looking truck. I like the colors on it, that the, the green and the gray, kind of the, the simplistic color scheme, black and white kind of. It's, it's a little bit high contrast, but with some green accents in there, and I like it. I think that um, white and green is a pretty good mix. It is, I agree. Okay, and we're going to be going against Backwards Bob, as per usual on these head-to-head uh, -head events. We seem to always start going against Backwards Bob. I guess that's just the way that the game is coded. Oh, and again. It's going to be confusing. <laughs> Backwards Bob. Backwards We don't know which direction he's going, right? We are in Glendale, Arizona. Oh, man, I went off the track there too long. Wait, why is he going backwards? Because <laughs> that's his shtick. He's backwards, Bob. Man, I just can't hit that jump right. Hey, at least you got the crash car. I did get the crash car, but this isn't a time destruction event. This is a race. Oh, the crowd is cheering loudly, though. But for who? For me, of course. Who else would they? They wouldn't be cheering for backwards. Bob, I'm Gravedigger. <laughs> All right, next up, the big pink gumball, Monster Mutt Poodle. Since when did poodles have that big of jaws? <laughs> that just shows how fierce she is. Nice. Okay, so what, you know, I've been trying after watching a bunch of Monster Jam events in real life, uh, I've been trying to go a little bit slower over the jump right there, and then slowing down right there before we go make that turn so that I don't skid quite so much. You can just see it in the background just going, I can't, I believe I can fly. Yeah, it doesn't really matter a whole lot if I, uh, if I slow down when I hit the jump and I rotate and over rotate end up spinning out, but oh well. Ah, that's that race. <laughs> grave Digger versus Grave Digger. Grave Digger versus Grave Digger. And I tell you what, if it were any other truck, I would question it. Like, what? How is it Grave Digger versus Grave Digger? It doesn't but, make any sense. But there's a lot of Grave Diggers. There is a lot of Grave Diggers since it's, since it's Grave. I mean, it, it, any event could have multiple Grave Diggers at it. So it totally makes sense. It oh. kind of makes sense with Monster Mutt. Yes, except that there's not more than one regular Monster Mutt. There's different types of Monster Mutts. But Monster Mutt himself is only one original Monster Mutt. Whereas Grave Digger, there is only one Grave Digger. Or, I'm sorry, there are multiple Grave Diggers. There's a bunch of original Grave Diggers. Now my mind went to think of how many Monster Tracks it would make sense with other <laughs> Maybe Max D. I think Max D is the only one other one that has multiple trucks. Hello, Megalodon. Yeah, we're f finishing off with Megalodon. I, again, this is just the way the AI is coded. We always seem to go against the same trucks in the same order. That's another reason why I'm not a big fan of the big show. Ugh, come on. But I mean, we get to look at Megalodon more so. Aha, that is true. Megalodon is a cool truck. Oh, slow down, not too much though. Going over the crush cars, cut the corner a little too sharp there. All right, one more time around. Here we go. Almost there, no! It's so weird how your tires aren't that dirty. It's almost as if it's a video game. <laughs> Alright, we won! There's our championship 
roster right there. All right, moving on to our two wheel skills event. Go, here we are. Oh man. Crush cars. Crush. Well, we don't need to get crush cars. We're trying to do two wheel skills. There we go. Oh, well. <laughs> That was kind of a good moonwalk. Let's see if we can get a backflip in there. Ooh. Nice backflip wow. with the wheelie. Nice. For a second there, your tires were moving like they were walking. And I was about to say, hey, it's it, way bigger. It's a human now. Ah, he was waddling like a duck, wasn't he? Or baby. Let's get a nice. Oh, I guess, well, that was all of my two wheel skills. Do me a huge favor, though, before we get moving into our. Time destruction event, smash that like button. It really does help get these videos out to more people. Let's us know that we're doing a good job and you want to see more videos like this one. And then also run over the subscribe button because we're trying to get to a thousand. <laughs> run over the subscribe button, that's right. If you haven't done so already, appreciate every subscription. Every subscriber out there, we really appreciate you. Destroy it like these plates. Destroy it like the outhouses. And maybe we'll launch some balloons into the air like these dice blocks. <laughs> oh, what do you think? Would that be a good video to do, Joseph? Should we uh, have a... Whoa! That was a crazy move. Should we have a... When we get to a thousand subscribers, should we have like a dice block that we has filled with balloons and we just open it up and... Maybe we'll just crush it with our uh, 24th scale grave digger. <laughs> that would be pretty cool. That would be pretty cool, huh? <laughs> Have a bunch of balloons and we'll crush it with our grave digger and pop open a bunch of balloons when we hit a thousand subscribers. I think that'd be awesome. Whenever you show the bus, my mind immediately loops right on the magic school bus. <laughs> yeah, that was a good backflip right there. Let's see if we can do it again on this side. Coming around. Let's do the backflip. Get the blimps. Nice! Look at that! Oh, that was so good! I don't always get good ones like that, but that was really good. Look at all the fences. I have no doubt in my mind that we're in first place. We're just smashing up stuff just to smash up stuff. Because destruction is cool, especially when you're eating people. Yeah! Oh, look at all this stuff over here we haven't crushed yet. Surprised you haven't popped a single one. Yeah! I was actually watching a live event where they had crushables filled with balloons like that. And the truck ran over the, the crushable and all the balloons came flying out. It was fun. There's your magic school bus right there. Also, comment if you think that we should get a crush car or a mini version. Because every single monster truck we have opened, not a single one has a crush car. Oh, we need to get a monster truck with a crush car in it, huh? Or should we... Should we just get some Hot Wheels or Matchbox cars that are that we use as crush cars? Well, the official one is probably <laughs> better than ones that can actually, you know, wheel away from you. <laughs> yeah, I was trying to get a good sky wheelie off those tires, and that did not work out well. There is a sky wheelie. Nice. That's much better. Almost got that big. Yeah. Man it! Oh! Nice. I, I'm doing backflips like a champ today, man. Woohoo! This time you actually got the beacon. I did! Big oh. air with a beacon! Oh! Oh! Almost, oh, got, oh. <laughs> almost got the wheelie! Almost! Almost! Nice! Get that crush car and get in the beacons. Yeah! Oh, there's a bunch of beacons over here. Let's see if we can get these. Two for one! Oh! oh just, just missed the crush car! Just missed it. Missed it. Nice! Oof! Let's get a backflip going off this. Get it! Get it! Nice! Man, oh. I am nailing every single backflip today. That's awesome. And you're doing it with a very cool truck. Yeah. Oh! Oh! Sky with the into. Oh no! Oh, okay. Went too far. Hyper rotated. Oh. What if a good donut if you were actually a donut? Well, it wasn't quite a donut, but it was a good power out. I saved it. Push 
Let's see. I think we can get a backflip off of this. And, Whoa. Oh, oh, um, <laughs> wait. Is that legal? Yeah, I don't think so. I don't think they want me back there, but, uh... Oh, that was weird. Ah, uh, these crates that are freestanding like this, they're good for doing corkscrews off them, but I missed my opportunity. No corkscrew. <laughs> Maybe next He's time. He's flopping around like a fish. I kind of am. <laughs> there we go. I guess the combo meter's still going. I can't see it because I've got my, uh, my HUD off. My uh, display is turned off. But I guess our combo is still going because <laughs> timer's out. All right. Well, that is going to do it for this episode. Thank you all for joining us. Be sure to check out the video you see on the screen right now, and we'll see you on the flip side later. Bye.